Thanks everybody for turning up. Joel Ben here, business analyst in the services team. The OAI, OAI PMH provider, um, which has been in the registry for quite a while now, is just our implementation of OAI. Um, it works, we basically use it um, as the main method of getting data into it, the ANTS registry, um, but people can also use it to get data out of the registry. Um, it obviously conforms with the OAI PMH spec, um, as everybody that's implemented it has to. People can use it to export records out of the registry from specific groups, which have been recently updated since the last time they asked us for data. Um, and again, it's just another way of, of providing things like peak lists or um, websites that display uh, records from sp specific providers. So again, just the address researchdataaustralia.ans.org.au forward slash developers. The web services themselves, um, they're not as pretty because there's no real fancy front end to them. There's obviously the description and the use cases for each of the services, how people might want to implement them and the useful points about, about them. There's a couple of, in some of the, the services, they're a little bit trickier. There's sort of some sort of FAQs or common questions about um, the services just to help out. Um, and a couple of example uses of uh, working um, service calls. Um, and that's pretty much all I've got. 